placing ads on facebook provides one of the most targeted advertising opportunities today facebook helps us build lasting connections with customers uh, using facebook ads instagram ads and ads clicking on whatsapp and messenger lots of people billions of people across the world use facebook or uh, which is now known as meta so uh, it makes sense uh, to create a course uh, where people uh, who are not uh, aware of what facebook is how they can use uh, facebook ads for the business uh, especially uh, small businesses uh, and students who would like to explore facebook ads uh, that's the main reason why uh, i created this course uh, so what to expect who the course is made for uh, well this course is made for students entrepreneurs or small business owners advertising professionals uh, looking for tips on creating facebook ads what skills you you will learn uh, in this course uh, in then uh, you will be able to understand different types of facebook advertising options and how to strategize create manage and optimize advertising campaigns yourself so uh, summarizing the goals of the course uh see the goals uh, are multiple uh, like you can create brand awareness uh, help your brand uh, get discovered uh, uh, to the potential customers uh, connecting with the customers or brand engagement uh, and uh, inspiring them to buy ultimately sales is the final outcome that every business is looking for so what's exciting and different uh, about uh, this course uh, this course is specifically designed to meet the needs of, of the above mentioned target audience uh, it goes uh, beyond theoretical concepts and uh, provides hands on practical training uh, with real world examples uh, there will be quizzes exercises and uh, there will be uh, projects also uh, uh, after the course and uh, Uh, i'll share uh, several resources that i've used uh, to create the course uh, with you about facebook ads and uh, uh, how to uh, uh, create uh, facebook ads using tools like canva let's see the course uh, outline we'll start with the creating automated ads and then we'll see how uh, we can use uh, text photos and videos uh targeted uh, to specific audiences uh and uh, duration uh, several bidding strategies uh budget and placement and uh, uh how uh, you can use multiple creatives which options that are available on facebook uh, to promote your business and uh, uh the payment method that uh, you can use uh, uh, boosting a post uh, uh will show you how to create an ad uh, from your page content uh your facebook and instagram posts uh, and how you can boost that post and using more advanced tools like uh, ads the ads manager and meta business uh, suite and uh, we will also uh, discuss a case study at the end of the course so let's begin so the topic one uh, for this course is uh, creating automated ads on facebook so here you can see uh, my facebook page and uh, uh, you can see uh, there's a logo and at the top it uh, shows facebook logo and then manage uh, page and uh, there are several uh, tabs uh, like professional dashboard insights ad center create ads and then uh, on the right hand side is my page with several options uh, and uh, uh let's click on ad center uh, so as soon as we click on ad center uh, you come uh, to this page uh, uh, where you can see the advertise uh, button uh, right in the center you'll have to click on this advertise uh, button or tab and here you see uh, uh, various options uh, choose ad type so for automated ads uh, like if you're completely uh, fresh or new and you have not uh, handled the facebook advertising before uh, this is the easiest uh, way to create facebook ads and uh, uh, facebook will uh, basically uh, guide you at every uh, step uh, of creating the ads so uh, from here uh, you click on uh, this uh, 
uh, tab, there are three tabs, uh, get started with automated ads, create new ads and boost a post. So when we click on get started with automated ads, uh, it will, it says that uh, let's create an, uh, your personalized page. Uh, click on this uh, tab, uh, which says get started. So uh, it's a kind of a questionnaire uh, that appears and you just have to uh, choose uh, the most relevant option that is there for your business and uh, click on next. Do you want people? Uh, it says, do you want people to come to your business location? Uh, you can choose either yes or no, or this doesn't apply to me. And uh, then you can uh, choose uh, on the next button. Do you have a website? Uh, there will be several options and you choose the best or the relevant option to your business and click on next. So I've said, uh, uh, I've used an, uh, yes as the option. And uh, do people buy products on your website? Uh, yes or no, choose the best option. Then do people book appointments on your website? Uh, do you get leads through your website? Choose the best option. Do you want people to contact you? How do you want people to contact you? Select all that applies. So you there are uh, four four options uh, out of which you can select all, or uh, the option uh, that uh, is best for your business. For your business, click on next. Where is your audience located? So you can choose the location. Let's say uh, if I choose uh, New Delhi. So uh, you can uh, choose uh, new, uh, new Delhi in the uh, metro station or whichever is the best option that you uh, feel. Then click on next. What are some topics that your audience might like? Uh, so I've uh, chosen uh, digital data uh, and uh, media communication. Uh, you can add uh, your interest. Uh, let's say uh, if my audience uh, is uh, students who are interested in digital marketing, so I can choose digital marketing. Uh, as an interest, then I can choose media as uh, uh, one of my in, in, uh, interests. Uh, or uh, whichever is the most relevant option for you, you uh, choose those interests uh, based on the target or audience that you've chosen and you click on next. Then uh, create your ad versions. Uh, here I have, uh, 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 this is the logo, uh, my brand logo. Then several images are there. You can uh, add uh, uh, up to uh, six uh, uh, images and uh, it will create six ad uh, versions or you can uh, choose a uh, video uh, as well. So, uh, so I've chosen two and, uh, and uh, let's, uh, let's click on the next button. So uh, now it says, choose your goal, get more uh, messages on uh, messenger. Uh, and it says recommended. It's up to you what you want to use, get more leads and uh, get more uh, bookings. Use the book now button to send people to your website to schedule an appointment. There are other options as well, get more uh, traffic. Uh, so you can choose any of these options. So uh, let's say uh, if I choose uh, get more traffic, so um, uh, it will uh, basically, uh, it's, it's showing my website URL. It's a free page that I've created on Wix. And uh, uh, so it will uh, get more traffic onto my website. So it has created uh, two ad uh, versions uh, for me. And uh, let's click on this ad option. So uh, you can see and edit uh, the versions. Uh, headline is there, description is there. Uh, and uh, button label, what you want to uh, add in the button label, apply now, book now, or contact us, download a form, learn more. So I have uh, chosen uh, learn more here. You can choose uh, the most relevant option uh, for your business.
so uh, settings uh, you can uh, then you see the payment uh, settings and the budget setting daily budget uh, uh, it's by default it's showing 260 uh, rupees uh, based on uh, the target audience that i've chosen uh, target market and estimated uh, for 260 rupees per day it says uh, it can give up to 45 to 129 uh, clicks and i can change the budget I can change the budget and it's pretty easy. Let's say 100 rupees uh, is the budget that I've chosen and du duration continuous. And let's say what's uh, will automatically adjust your ads for better performance. You can edit uh, or turn off automated ads anytime. So um, duration again, uh, it chooses automatically and uh, it will be continuous. Uh, based on uh, as it uh, says that it will turn off uh, the automated ads and uh, you can turn uh, the automated ads and any time so uh, and it will automatically adjust your ads for better performance special ad category uh, it's like elections and uh, you know those uh, like uh, ads about credit employment housing social issues elections or politics so uh, if uh, there is a special ad category you can specify then audience uh, advantage audience is what uh, uh, it says and uh, otherwise you can uh, you can choose uh, your audience uh, this audience is based on your page details and will automatically adjust over time and audience details uh, it has uh, given united states you can edit this basically uh, and uh, now you can specify the age and people let's say if we choose edit the audience uh, you can choose uh, either, either do you want to target everyone or just men or women then you can choose the age group age group location you can choose uh, detail targeting you can specify interests and uh, audience uh, definition it will give you some idea of uh, the audience your audience selection is fairly broad and uh, estimated size also it gives So, are you sure you want to close? So, uh, this is how we choose the audience, and then on placements, you can choose uh, the placements uh, from these platforms. Uh, you do you want to run your placements on or ads on Facebook, Instagram, or Messenger? and uh, choose your where your ads will appear most platforms improve results so you can pick and choose i can remove messenger and save uh, placements and choose facebook and instagram only so uh, now i've chosen uh, uh, the uh, placements as well and the payment method i've told you you can choose the play, play, uh, payment method uh, that you want to add and click on the promote now button So now it uh, tells me uh, that I have to add uh, the business or tax information that is optional and uh, add payment method. I have a credit card. Uh, let's say I have an ad credit to claim uh, and uh, even with an ad credit, you'll need to add payment method to run the ads. So uh, you have to, you'll have to add the payment method. So when you click uh, on the next button, uh, uh, it again show you, shows you uh, uh, your uh, uh, you'll have to uh, specify your payment method. Otherwise, uh, like credit card, if you're using, you'll basically uh, save that. It will save that information. So and uh, uh, like uh, it will not uh, 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 show uh, ads to your audience unless uh, you choose a payment method and specify how you're going to pay. So this is uh, the last step in creating uh, uh, in, uh, you know, how you can run a Facebook ad in uh, the automated mode. And uh, uh, in the next topic, we'll learn how to create ads using uh, actual images or videos and uh, text uh, yourself. Uh, I mean, in which Facebook doesn't help you. Uh, it won't be an automated ad. It will be 
um, the ad uh, uh, that you create yourself. So uh, let's go to the next topic.